you ever get so tired you don't feel like drinking bourbon? <laughs> Me neither. Cheers, yo. Oh, I didn't get tired of that. Howdy y'all, it is day 10, Saturday, December 10th, that means bottle 10, from the 25 days of bourbon. Saturday night, hope you guys' weekend is going well. I don't want to keep it tonight, so let's just do this one, get it knocked out. Nice nose. Kind of a sweet fruit to it, but nothing standing out like a particular fruit. Just kind of sweet and fruity. Cheers, y'all. Does have some peppery spice hitting probably mid tongue for me. Bit of a sweetness to it, kind of rolling in. Kind of nutty bacon spice. little hug starting let me know what you guys think in the comments about bottle 10 Jay Mattingly this is a light whiskey blended picked by uh, HCBC named Fantasy Island and this one was bottled at 134 proof if I remember correctly, I was on this pick. If I remember correctly, I can't find my notes. Um, I believe the blend was two 14 years and one seven year, and I forget the exact uh, percentages. But I'm pretty sure it was two 14s and one seven that was blended together. Um, it was a pretty good pick. Uh, still tastes pretty good to me. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments please I'm not going to go into Jay Mattingly uh, we just had a Jay Mattingly bottle uh, a few days ago and where I went in uh, I'm talking about their process and what they do out there so um, if you want to hear that again just go ahead and refer back to the other uh, pick with Jay Mattingly so I won't get into it and, and keep you all up all night bottle 10 Jay Mattingly HCBC Fantasy Island bottled at 134 proof. Hope you guys enjoy it. Have a great night. Stay safe out there, y'all. I don't drink a drive, but do drink. Take care of yourself and all your loved ones. And as always, bourbon on, y'all.